Hi, my name is Dr. Omar Gonzalez, and I want to welcome you. Well, I was born in Rio Rama, Tamaulipas, Mexico. I was raised in Monterrey, Mexico. I did all my schooling years over there. Um, and then when I finished med school, um, I was about to do plastic surgery when I decided to drop that and, and met Dr. Maurice Mossad, my, my French uh, teacher, uh, mentor in acupuncture. So I did the French school of acupuncture for three years after being a medical doctor. Uh, and then I practiced that technique for, for many years until recently that I, I went to China in the year 2000 and, and all like right now I'm using uh, a very Chinese uh, form of acupuncture. Um, besides that, uh, besides my acupuncture uh, training, I've been doing anti-aging techniques for a while. Uh, for 16 years I've been doing this form of uh, therapy uh, when that uses uh, live cells uh, to treat many, many conditions, especially autoimmune conditions and difficult conditions, and MS patients, ALS patients, um, RP or retinitis pigmentosa patients, and they're responding very, very good. This is something that's not done easily, and we're providing that uh, that technique. I'm combining uh, the acupuncture, my acupuncture background, plus these other new techniques in, in regenerative medicine or integrative medicine. My primary concern is to integrate both kinds of medicine: the traditional Chinese plus uh, the Western medicine. So we've come uh, to develop these techniques. Uh, for longevity purposes and for regenerative uh, purposes. Uh, so we're using uh, both technologies. I've been practicing acupuncture for 20 years. I'm a specialist in human acupuncture. Over the years, I've been uh, exposed to many different techniques, many, many different methods of treatment, and so I've been in the process of integrating uh, these methods into something powerful, something that's effective. Now he's got the room and the supplies to make it even better. Can you see how much that pad goes yeah, down? Just to, with, I mean, like you can see that that's just amazing. Mm -hmm. It's so swollen before. Hi, I'm uh, 78 years old. And my next birth to be 79, of course, and that isn't very far away. Hopefully, I'll. Uh, uh, have a healthy life till the day I have to go. My name is William F. Mills. Everybody calls me Bill. Uh, I've been doctoring with the Dr. Omar for around 15 years when my uh, I had the lip was very bad. In fact, I figured I was going to die. And my wife found out about Dr. Omar, and I've had four treatments, and I'm very healthy. I ride. Uh, 800 cc Suzuki motorcycle. I'm uh, very active. I go dancing twice a week. 
and uh, everything is fine. I just finished having one about three weeks ago, and uh, hopefully I'll get another one. Okay, my name is Lucy Lopez. Eh, estoy muy contenta de, de por casi cerca de 20 años estar me tratando con el doctor. Ah, tuve problemas con una neuropatía de pie diabético y ahorita estoy muy bien. Con los implantes ah, recupero energía, fuerzas, me siento bastante bien. Eh, mis problemas de riñón no los he tenido hasta ahorita. Tengo 28 años de ser diabética y he estado en condiciones buenas de salud. Eh, estoy bien agradecida con el doctor porque tiene un, un buen tratamiento. Y lo recomiendo bastante. He eh, sobrevivido sin muchos problemas y una dieta a mi diabetes. Todos mis, uh, mis problemas ¿verdad? son por mi diabetes y todo, y vengo con él y me siento muy bien. Todas sus terapias son muy buenas. This is my daughter Alicia, and she's here for a stem cell implant. It's uh, her second one. And she came last May, and we saw so much benefit from it, uh, we knew we had to do it again. And she has Usher syndrome, and that causes you to be born deaf, and then you lose your sight later to retinitis pigmentosa. And according to the doctors in the U.S., there is absolutely nothing that can be done at this point in time. And I wasn't willing to sit and wait and watch that happen to her, so um, we found Dr. Gonzalez, and he's made such a difference. Um, we have hope now that Alicia's not going to lose her sight. I just really believe in this treatment and hope that other people can find out about it and know that there's something they can do. Hi, I'm Cindy. I'm here to tell you about my adventure or my journey that I've been on with my daughter, Mandy, who's been a patient of Dr. Omar's for the last 15 years. She's 27 years old. She was born with spina bifida. She has uh, a VP shunt on the right side, which was placed uh, from being hydrocephalic at birth. And she has a, uh, an, a condition called Arnold uh, Chiari malformation. And then she also uh, suffers from medullary sponge kidneys. Uh, Mandy and I uh, have been in uh, many hospitals all over the United States and now in Mexico. To look like it, look at it from the outside. You you wouldn't even know to come in here. Okay. Because on the outside of the building, it doesn't look like it looks on the inside. That's the other thing about Mexico. We travel all over Mexico and go to all kinds of places and you never know what's behind the door. <laughs> and this new building he has is pretty. It's very accommodating. People say all kinds of things about coming to Mexico and it's not scary and it's a great place. I was the, one of the first patients that ever had the placenta implants. And without those stem cell implants, now Mandy would have had a kidney transplant she would have uh, a rash that I don't know what we do with. So Dr. Omar has uh, provided Mandy with uh, stem cell implants. The implants have most definitely given Mandy a, uh, a better quality of life. We are uh, so very lucky and so um, uh, feel like we've just been given a gift to have uh, Dr. Uh, Gonzalez. And I know that he does um, give her um, placenta injections and another type of an herbal injection that he injects for her and that's how he has created the quality of life that Mandy has right now with the Chiari. Without those injections and without those implants Mandy would have to have um, uh, Chiari surgeries. She has 100% trust and faith in him. There's never a question. Come join us. Yeah. <laughs> yeah.